Creating simple formulas in Excel is a breeze, but creating complex ones can be a little trickier. To make things easier, Excel has pre-built formulas called functions. Here's a list of some of them. You can find the average of a group of numbers, or the sum. A function normally uses one or more cell references. Single cell references, like this one, tell Excel to round the number found in cell C4 to two decimal places. You can also use cell ranges in a function. This formula tells Excel to add up all the numbers found in cells A4 through A9. Creating this type of formula uses something called contiguous or adjacent cell ranges. You can also use non-contiguous cell ranges. This equation will add the numbers found in cells A4, B7, and C11, so the cells are found in different areas throughout your spreadsheet. Now to use a function, click in the cell where you want to create a formula. Then click the Formulas tab. Click whichever function you want. You can click Financial to calculate business-related equations like the amount of interest earned over a specific time period. Or you can search and manipulate text. There are literally hundreds to choose from. Once you decide what you want to do, click a category and a pull-down menu appears with a list of available functions. Click a function and the Function Arguments dialog box appears. Specify which cell references have the data you want to calculate. Then just click OK. Excel displays your calculation. One of the most useful and commonly used commands in Excel is AutoSum. It uses the SUM function to add two or more cell references without making you type them in yourself. So you can add an entire row or column of cells together. Once you create a column or row of numbers you want to add, click at the bottom of the column or to the right of the row. Next, find the AutoSum icon in the Function Library group and click it. Excel automatically creates a sum function in the cell you chose and highlights all the cells it wants to retrieve data from. If you accidentally click the downward arrow on the AutoSum function and a pull-down menu appears, just choose Sum. The AutoSum command automatically creates cell references for the sum function. Just press Enter and it adds up all those references. Instead of digging around for the functions you use most often, you can access a list of recently used ones. Click the cell where you want to use a function. In the Function Library group, click the Recently Used icon. A pull-down menu appears. Then just choose your function. The more functions you use, the more your list will vary. So compute away. Whether it's simple addition or calculating house payments, equations are easy with Excel.